going on? How you doing? I'm doing all right. So when I walked up to you and I said Kajana, and you pretended you weren't Kajana, yeah. that's because your real name's not Kajana, right? No, my name is Kajana. Don't, don't. My name is Kajana, and normally I'm not, I'm not a big person for all the attention things, so I try to stay low key. Well, you lend your celebrity for this amazing event for FSMA, so thank you for that. It is. It's, it's a great event. I met Lil Madison last year at the golf golf outing, and it's for a great cause. And you know, they asked me to come for this gala, and I didn't hesitate to come. We so appreciate that. Now, Kajana, what do you know about being a first round first pick? I don't know. Why don't you tell me? <laughs> What do you know about that? What does that feel like? Uh, I really, like now, you kind of reflect on it because you see it every time the draft comes up, they show my face. But you know, like I said, I'm not a guy who's caught up in all that. You no, know, it's, it's a, definitely a blessing. The more thing I'm just happy is because I finally made it to the NFL and I, and I told my mom I would make it. Exactly. And before the NFL, you were key in Penn State's offense, right? And that perfect undefeated season in 94. What did it feel like that year? Wow, you feel like you know, you know my whole side. Are you, are you from Pennsylvania or something? No. No, no it was good, though, you know, because I've been on um, a lot of teams, and that's like the second team ever I've been on undefeated. So, you know, doing that in the Big Ten, and we had to try to do a chance for the national championship. You no, know, but being the last team at Penn State to do that, you know, definitely a great honor, and you know what? We had great teammates. You like the Gators? What kind of shoes? Be careful now. You're talking about shoes? Be careful now. <laughs> I'm talking about you. purses? I'm a Gator. Come on, give our Gators a shout out. Florida, Florida Gators? Honestly, I respect them. They're, you know, whenever Meyer was there, he did a great job. Like Tim Tebow? Yeah, I like, he got good morals. He's a good dude. What about I, I the NFL? Better, I, he's a winner. I mean, obviously, every, everything that's, that he does is totally unconventional. It's not your your great throw, the drop back steps or your tight spiral he makes the completions we need to and he's been winning so he wins and cam newton has better stats individually right but tim tebow is winning hey 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 well that's different i mean you know what cam newton is a, a two he's a we, stud we're not gonna get into the whole debate but no they're both they're both highly chosen winner they're, they're both great players and it's good to see that young guys now are getting an opportunity to play and when they are getting an opportunity to play they are succeeding too tonight jets are at denver jets are favored by six who you got Who's your favorite team? My favorite team? Denver because of Tebow. Really? Uh, Are you that much yes. of a Tebow fan? No, I'm a Gator fan, but hey, I love Tebow. You do like the Tebow? Right now. No, I don't know what it is. What is it? I, I can't do it. Yeah, you're I don't want to make fun of religion. That's not make fun of religion. Exactly. That's what. But uh, who I think is going to win? Ladies and gentlemen, I don't know, but I think the Jets are going to win. They got a better defense. All right, let's talk Super Bowl. Who you got? Who you got? No, this year is a throw. I mean, obviously, NFC. You, you cannot not think the Packers are not going to go back because they're loaded. Hey, it is what it is. Hey, Roger's you know, done. They are, they are loaded. Now, the AFC, there's probably like five teams right now. The Dolphins, right? Honestly, are, are, you, are, you, are you from Miami? Yeah. See, I'm not even from Miami, and you doing a show like that down here in Miami. What about Heisman? Who's going to get it this year? Ooh, you know what? Obviously, every beginning of the season, everybody's going to get the Andrew Luck. And he had a great season. I'm going Trent. No, I like him. He's not gonna get it. Just, just like the quarter. I think the quarterback for Oklahoma State now is getting real hot, and they're winning. Um, the kid from Baylor, uh, Robert Griffin, the, uh, Robert he's, something the third, the RG three the third. Yeah. Trent Richardson is a great running back, but if anything, I would I would give it to I like Michael running James. backs. I like running backs. Like running backs? <laughs> Will there be an NBA season this year? You know what? I certainly hope so. Are you a basketball fan? I am. Yeah. What nationality are you? I'm Indian and Greek. Are you? What does that have to do with basketball? Are you flirting? No, nah, that's just that's just He's honest. Flirting question. with me? No, nah, I'm doing that. No, nah, just it just depends. I mean, because you say you like basketball. I, I mean, love basketball. yeah, a lot of women like basketball. Not to be the stereotype, why? Because it's a lot easier to understand. No, it's because it's indoors and we always have a good hair day. And and you can dress all nice and look all diva and and, and do what you got to do. Me personally, I hope there is. Uh, but at the same time, just like the, with the NFL lockout, you no, know, the, the NBA players doing solidarity and it, sooner or later, both sides got to give. I it's agree. It's got to be a win-win both sides. And right now, it's like either one side's trying to win or the other side's trying to win. So I hope for the better for us because after football's done, I mean, right now, I'm happy because football's there. But when that's done, you know, there's like four or five months. It's low, and then, then baseball season comes up. I just hope that they're all fit when basketball does come back. When all these allegations happened about 10 days ago, uh, I flew up last week for the game. You did? Yeah, I flew Against up. Against Nebraska. 
Yeah, we flew up and about 300 lettermen came in there and uh, really show a solidarity. I mean, granted, all the allegations and everything that has happened to our image and our brand is, is terrible and, and not once do you condone what's going on up there in the, in the university. But at the same time, these kids that are on the field have nothing to do with all this stuff that's happening in the media. And granted, that's blown out of proportion. So what we wanted to do is nobody talked to each other, all these lettermen. We all just went there because that's the type of tight family we had. And it's like, um, it's, like a it's like a brother and a brotherhood. And we wanted to show the kids on the field, say, you know what? No matter what is going on across the world right now, because there's a lot of negative publicity going around with the university. And, and right now, rightfully so, until everything comes out, I understand. But the 100,000 people that are in there in that stadium had their back. And then the, the 300 guys that are former lettering that was in their in their place got their back, and and that's one thing we really wanted to show. Because you know you worked with you worked with Coach Paterno, and he actually convinced you to go to the NFL, right, a year early. Yeah, um, yeah. After the Rose Bowl, um, we sat down and sat down with me and my mom, and I was contemplating what I was going to do. You no, know, I knew I was going to graduate um, in the spring, which was something that's dear to me. I told my mom I promised promised I would do that. But he just told me to say, you know what, you did all you can, and there's no need for you to come back. You know, you're not only in the NFL. Let's talk about BioGlobe. What the heck is that? Yeah, you know, well, BioGlobe is a company I started about three years ago. Um, it's an environmental company. We, uh, we, 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 take, we do um, eco-friendly products. We're a green initiative, so everything I have is all green. It's either eco-friendly or green, so we have green chemicals for cleaning from home to health care to school. Thank you so much for coming out tonight. You are great and thank you for lending your celebrity for FSMA. Not my celebrity but you know what thanks for having me though.